Hello, um, this is Sabotage Life, showing you another video on Skyrim. This one is the steps into getting the unlimited novice magicka. So first you just boot up the story and don't use, uh, this is the uh, Xbox One uh, remastered version. So don't use any mods in order to get to this part. So this is just the standard beginning. Alright, and when you get to this spot where you can either go this way to the right or this way to the left, just go to the left over here. Okay, and then when you get to this spot, there's these three cages, and you just have to uh, unlock that middle one. Okay, and then on this corpse, you get the novice robes and novice hood. The novice hood is what you need. It increases your magicka by 30 points. So don't forget to pick this up. Now, if you want to uh, level up your sneak pretty fast, just go to this area where there's those three cages, sneak, and then just go towards the wall and just make sure that you can see the guy and just push towards the wall. If you keep doing this, you'll just level up your sneak pretty fast. So all you have to do is, yeah, see? Um, I'm not gonna do that right now, but I'll just do it a little bit, just to see how you, just so you can see how fast it is to level up your sneak at this point. Um, I believe you can get to, all the way up to sneak level 100 this way, and get to about level 10, or 15 I think um, but anyways this is a nice little sneak spot just like I said just sneak and just keep pushing towards the wall really easy way to get your sneak up all right then you make it out of the Looks cave like he's gone for good keep going this way but I don't think we should stick around it's probably best if we split up good luck I wouldn't have made it without your help today. All right, from this spot, we're just going to head our way to Riverwood, and then we're going to go to White Run. Um, but we might make a little detour, go over here to get that Lady Stone. I believe it's like right there. All right, we made our way from the start, Helgen, where we escaped the dragon. Found one of the warriors, the Guardian Stones. It was the warrior. We went over here to the Lady Stone to get blessed. Came back, went to Riverwood, and then we made our way to White Run, and then finally to Dragon's Reach. Uh, I probably sold a variety of different stuff to get to about 1,059 coins, which is needed in order to do this trick. So, again, we're in Dragon Reach. We're in this area where you talk to the Jarl, and on the right there is the Arcane Enchanter. But first, we'll talk to this guy, and we'll buy the uh, the, the greater soul gem. Oh, I thought you were already. So you wish to master the arcane art. So we'll buy the greater soul gem, filled with a greater soul for one thousand fifty nine coins. All right, now we go to this arcane enchanter. 
We are going to disenchant that novice hood we picked up earlier. So let's do that. And you see that since we destroyed it, it says you learned the Fortify Magicka enchantment from destroying this item. Let's go ahead and hit OK. All right, so now let's go ahead and enchant this item. So we're going, it only use, it only works with helmets. So we select helmet, go to the enchantment, fortify magicka, go to the soul gem where it says greater soul gem. And you'll see that it says increases your magicka by 13 points. Oh, I thought you were already so we'll go ahead and craft this item. Okay. And let's see if it's unlimited. So we'll go to flames and healing. And we'll see if it's unlimited. Oh, it is not unlimited. That's because we forgot an important step. So let's go ahead and remove this helmet. And we'll go to our skills menu. On the bottom left corner, you'll see Magicka is at 100. We haven't leveled up our character at all yet. So I believe we can do it two times, which is perfect, because we need to get the Magicka to 120. So let's exit this. Okay, so there, there we go. It says, you leveled up. Choose an attribute, attribute to advance. So we're going to do the Magicka. So you'll see on the bottom left-hand corner, it's going to go up to 110. There you go. And we'll do it one more time. There you go, now we're at 120 Magicka, which it has to be. You can't go any higher, and it has to be exactly 120. Um, and let's see, it's really good to use this uh, for low level characters, probably from between level one to level 20, I would say. All right, so now let's go ahead and equip our helmet. And let's see if it's unlimited. There you are, see? The Magicka meter ran out, but it's still going. So this is Unlimited Novice Magicka. So we're going to actually pause it now. We're gonna do some battle, and I'll show you this in combat. All right, we're going to uh, come up to some bandits. So let's go ahead and test out this new ability that we have. So see, now since we have unlimited healing, we can just uh, work on our armor, light armor, heavy armor, medium armor, medium armor, and then along with restoration. There you go, heavy armor increased. If you're killing like a big item, like a giant, uh, then you can work on your destruction magic as well. Um, if you, if the enemy is very powerful, you can just double your um, healing. Use both hands to heal. But anyways, that's what you can do with this unlimited novice magic. Thanks for watching.